No, 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 I know what I'm doing. Hi there, folks, it's me, the Mad Scientist. You remember that robot from the last episode? Well, we had another one, and we had to buy that one because this one broke. So I have my friend here, Ron, fixing it. It's, uh, the process is called soldering. Not sure why, don't ask. <laughs> but, um, the science behind this is, you can't just weld, uh, st um, electrically conducting stuff onto metal. So, you have to do a process called soldering. And we are going to be doing that. So, Tell me if I'm in your way. No, it's fine. Do, so, uh, right now he is uh, twisting the copper, and I'm going to hand the uh, camera over to David. Um, Ron, do you have anything to add to this? No, to like the video. Oh no, I don't. I thought you wanted to add like uh, a shot of bourbon. <laughs> yeah, no. I've seen what alcohol does to people, <laughs> and after looking at my dad's girlfriend, I am no longer interested. Ah. I'm just kidding. But anyways. Yeah. David, what do you think of this process? Um, I never knew about this. I just thought welding would just work with it, you know? Once again... Proving why he brought me onto this channel. Alright. So, if you are all wondering how I managed to break this, I was fiddling with the head and it snapped off. Oh, man. But, the connection didn't break, just the wires. What was the first words out of your mouth when it broke? I'd rather not say them. Darn. Uh, pretty much, yeah. I promised myself I'd stop cussing in these videos. <laughs> good Thank thinking. You. Yeah. David, have I been doing a good job with that? Yeah. Okay. You only say it when it's needed to, or that's how you say it. I don't know. Yeah. I only say it when necessary or when something goes wrong. Alright folks, <coughs> I asked if this was a fire hazard and he said no, so I should be wearing my gloves right now, but I'm not. Alright David, cut back to me. Okay, so. Um, like I said, you can't just weld an electrically conducting piece of something onto a piece of metal. Because it might, like, interfere with the, um, electrical conduction, like I said. Now, electricity. I bet most of you are wondering why I didn't teach that before this. The reason? I forget. Call me the mad scientist for a reason. Alright, now. We have officially run out of ideas. So, some of you guys will, uh... You know, post ideas for us. And yes, I know one of you has posted an idea. But to do that, we're going to need five gallons of root beer. <laughs> a playground that is equipped with a merry-go-round. And a willing adult to take us there. So, until we get those four things... We really need the Mountain Dew? I mean, the root beer. Four gallons of root beer? Yeah. Who doesn't need four gallons of root beer? No, for the video. I'm talking about the video. I'm... That'll take some thinking. Pause the video. Play now. I have come to my decision. The answer is yes, you need four gallons of root beer.
I know this process might seem a little boring, but to you ungrateful losers, this is the way life works. Not everything happens in the blink of an eye. All right, David, cut back to me. All right, now, we're thinking of a do doing a, um, a 4th of July special on fireworks. So will some of you guys post your preferred firework? Um, and we will see if we can get a hold of it. Alright, back to the process. Okay, where's this go? Where's this go? Oh, that goes... See this little slot there? The, um... Gear to gear. Gear to gear. Yeah, that tiny gear to the bigger gear. And then this is on top, right? Yeah. Now, is there like a waiting period for us to, uh... No, this should be ready to go. Good to go? Okay. Well. And we have some time left in the video. Oh, yeah, just enough time to show it in action. Thank you for being on the show. Does it work? Uh, yeah, that thing works great. How, how do you know it does? Because I tried it out before I accidentally broke it. Okay, we're going to need some salt. And do you have that equipped? Salt? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, Water? Yeah. Non-iodized salt is non what it says. Iodized. And if you don't, we got some at home, so we'll just uh, head back there if you don't. We've got iodized. Okay, so we're going to head home with our root beer. And, um, thank you. Once again, they are they are connected, right? Oh yeah, they're connected. We're good to go.